Welcome back to another video. Well, if you're here because, you know, following my channel, I guess, I don't know. I, I suck at intros, alright. But anyways, we got Subnautica pulled up. I had this game on my Xbox, and today I'm just gonna have a playthrough. See, these are all my different playthroughs on my Xbox. I'm just gonna do a playthrough for YouTube. And also, since I'm on PC, I'm gonna be able to use keyboard and mouse. So let's get straight into this game. being sent off from the Altera. There it goes. And it just blew up. God, this game never gets old. Fire extinguisher. There goes the panel. And then we're about to get knocked out. Boom! <laughs> Alright. So, this game is called Sonatica. Basically, it's an un aquatic game. It's a game about underwater exploration, uh, story building, pretty sure. Gotta be one of my favorite games. And, let's go ahead and get right into it. So, here we go. We got the PDA. You have and uh, we're going to boot it up. This it's gonna act as our inventory. Backup. Also, this we're gonna be able to do waypoints and stuff like that. So, since we picked up the fire extinguisher, alive. it's gonna be in our in inventory. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. As I said, we are in an alien world. Let me go ahead and go up here. <laughs> that never gets old. Alright, well, welcome to Subnautica. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have to find stuff to build a repair tool so we can fix our uh, little life pod here. So I have a damage radio. I came with several supplies, so let me grab half of these supplies. And without further ado, let's start going to explore this vast world called Subnautica. So right here we got our first limestone chunk. This will give us little resources, little amount of resources. Also, this game we have to always swim to the surface for oxygen. It's a nice little feature for a game. And right here we got metal salvages. We pick this up and it gives us four titanium each. So I'm just gonna go around collecting basic material. Oh, we got a crackfish there. I'm gonna go ahead and let him chase me. Alright, so there we go. Pretty sure he gives us cave sulfur, which is gonna be good for building the repair tool. Into him. I found one of my favorite favorite little fish in this game, the hoverfish. Look at that cute little smell. Alright, so I just got those little uh if you find seed clusters, they're gonna be able to give us silicone. Using the silicone we could also go to ourselves some uh some flippers so we could swim faster and I got titanium as well. It'll be able to help me get the um, better diving equipment. Can't speak today, sorry. Alright, we are back and I'm just gonna go ahead and start crafting all the stuff that we need, like uh, stuff for repair. Alright, I'm gonna be able to craft the repair bench. We're gonna be able to fix our life pod. It's nice. 
Alright, now we got the scanner. I'll put that in your eyes. Alright, so we just got basic materials. We got... Or basic tools, I would say. So we got the knife. Knife's gonna be really good. Uh... Let me go ahead and turn these into metal stuff. Well, not metal stuff, but titanium. I'm gonna go ahead and repair our life pod. Life pod secondary systems online. Running full environment diagnostic and outputting results to data bank. This is a wrong. The stress signal is saying. That's a long time. So I'm just gonna go out and try to find some quartz because we need to make a flashlight before it turns nighttime. Ooh, this might be a good place to find some quartz. Quartz all over the place. died there but we're good all right now we're back with all the stuff we need to make a flashlight now we can make a flashlight we've got a bunch more materials as well so with all this basic stuff i go ahead and start trying to go out and find uh basic stuff to research I'm gonna make two waterproof lockers real quick so I'll be able to store my stuff. Set these down. Alright, let's go look for some basic stuff to research. Alright, let me try to find Sea Glide. Bro, bro. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm That's just gonna hit it. Hopefully. Alright, there we go. I think things got my PDA even tweaking. Jeez. <laughs> Ooh, is that Sea Glide? Mobile vehicle there. Alright. Go ahead and scan it. Ooh, even more mobile vehicle there. Need one more. Alright. Is that. Looks like a sea moth fragment. It is, alright. Got another radio call, by the way. I need to go check that out. Ooh! Alright, that actually might be very worth, worth checking out. Life pod 7. Look at this, another sea moth fragment. Alright, there we go. Integrating new PDA data. I'm gonna check over here now. Yeah, that's sea moth. Fire reactor? Oh, scanner room. 30 seconds. Now you go. New PDA data. Yeah, I'm probably dead here. Not gonna lie. Wait, no, I got it. I got it. Laser cutter. Right, I'm gonna go get a better oxygen tank and then we're gonna come back over here. Oh, alright, we are back. Let me just play this radio message first and then let's get to crafting. This is Life Pod 3 uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Out. All right, so we're gonna have to go try to find them. All right. So we head over there next, cause Sea Glide. Oh, I need it. Oh wait, Sea Glide. 
Here we go. Lubricant and construction of vehicles and power plants. Oh, there we go, Sea Glide. The Sea Glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. All right. So the Sea Glide will help us traverse quite faster. Let me go ahead and put this stuff into the locker. If we have space, and we don't, do I have space in the big, big storage here? Uh, just a bit. All right, I'm gonna start heading out to that crashed, uh, sea glide place. So here we are at the crashed ship. Not that much left of the crew. Integrating new PDA data. Alright. Well, uh, let's just get going. So, let's go get some quartz. Could be somewhere in here, right? Quartz? This place is, uh, quite... Quite deep. Four quartz. And one silver. That's titanium. Mobile vehicle there. Oh, there we go. Got mobile vehicle bay down. Got another radio message as well. We go check that out. Here's our last piece of quartz. Now I just need one piece of silver. Ooh, trash can. All right. So just research myself. All right. Then just pop this medkit. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to take it. Alright, go ahead and listen to message. Let's get the crafting. This is Ozzy from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? They didn't want us. This might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim looking snake thing is trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Oh, that was Life Pod 17, so we already checked that out. It was already destroyed by the time we got there, so might as well take these two off. All right, time to upgrade our tank. We have one piece of silver, just need one piece. We have four. All right, so we're good. Now we just need to take this off. There you go. Alright, now that we have better oxygen tank, we go ahead and try to explore that crashed area by the uh, life pod 17. That was over there. Alright, let's go. There it is, life pod 17. Go ahead and explore this place over here. We got electrocuted. Alright, let's go in. Alright, see a chest, grab that. Water, more vehicle bed, we already got that. Laser cutter. And eventual death. Battery recharger. Oh, modification station. Another modification station. Right there, picture frame. I'm gonna start going out because my oxygen is getting pretty low. It's about to warn me. 30 seconds. Yep. Oh, another propulsion cannon. Blueprint 
gotta be fast when I'm doing this. I don't wanna drown. Ooh, floodlight. Uh, laser cutter as well. Alright, I need to start going. Let me grab this. Integrating new PDA data. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oxygen. Yeah, I'm dead. There's no way. Oh no way, I actually made that. <coughs> Did I just jump on water? What else do I want to make? I want to make a habitat builder next. Uh, conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2. Don't I have that? Rebreather? I don't. Alright. The wiring kit and fiber mesh. Here's the wiring kit. Here's the fiber mesh. And now we can make our rebreather. So I got that. I want to go ahead and start trying to make that. Plast- wait not plast- steel. Titanium ingot, lubricant, and power cell. So I need two batteries and silicon rubber. Let's grab these two mushrooms for batteries. Copper. These. Let's get to crafting. Let's make some lubricant. Let's make the titanium ingot. Let's make the batteries for the power cells. Alright, we got power cell. Congratulations, and let me see what else we need. Get the titanium for the ingot. There you go, mobile vehicle bay. Let's grab this. Another radio call, by the way. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora D. Reed. Over. Huh? the vacuum. These Altera ships, they run low on engine grease, send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's gonna have us blowing our credits, running errands for Altera. See what the long range scans pick up in the meantime. All right, so they don't believe that we're in a crisis. But anyways, that wraps up episode 1 of Subnautica, and honestly, this game is really fun. I played it on my Xbox, and I'm just going to make a playthrough for my YouTube, so y'all get to see. And anyways, make sure to like and subscribe, and also turn on notifications for any future uploads. I will definitely be making this a full series. Uh, I currently don't have Minecraft anymore, so I'm going to have to re-get that so I can resume our modded survival series. I'm gonna put a link to that video in the description so y'all get to watch that. I made two episodes on there. And without further ado, have a good day and goodbye.